I've gotten some questions about uh, battery update. Um, I'm going to check the voltage. I probably should have done that when I had all the covers off, but I'm gonna check the battery voltage, both uh, uncharged, it is dead dead now. Oh, it was dead dead, it's got a little bit of juice, but uh, ran it until it turned off and then I will charge it up and see where we're running voltage wise again. Uh, but so far, everything's been great. It's putting it to good use. Um, it's muddy, but uh, it's been good. So we'll see where we're at. Okay, not sure if you can see, but the bolts, the Allen head bolts on this side, they're actually on both sides. You need a really long Allen to open it. Um, and then before you take this cover off, you have to undo the clip. It's just really easy, usually. There we go. So now that cover's off. Now let's take some voltages. Okay, I got the covers off. So if I check the insides. Twenty-four point eight volts, and that is when it is dead. So I'm gonna get the cover put back on, uh, and then plug it in, and we'll see where we're at when it's all charged. Okay, I got full meter out. Uh, charging here, I'm getting 27.3 volts, and I was I didn't think about it the first time, but that's silly because there's a controller. So the power goes into the controller from the charger and then the controller charges the batteries. So the controller seems to be okay with 42 volts DC and it won't charge the batteries any faster than the controller anyway. Okay, okay here we go. 41.9 volts with it charged. So it must pass through because watch me unplug it. Unplug. 27.2. Charged. 